I, in this video, I will explain how can we capture path of a selected file and publish that path in any cell of Excel. If I click this button, then it will give me a browsing window and I can select any file. Let me click on desktop and select any file. When I click open, I can get the path captured through VBA and published on Excel sheet. So how can we do this? I will explain it step by step. First, we need to make sure that we have developer tab in our Excel sheet. Then I will click insert from ActiveX control. I will drag a button. I want that when I click on this button, I should be able to get the path of file in a particular cell let me highlight this cell for this cell you can see row number is 7 column is 4 so row 7 and column 4 I will again go to developer tab make sure we are on design mode I will double click on button and I will write the code B. B is a variable where I will store the path of file name for that I will write get open file name get open file name is a function which captures the path of any selected file and I am storing that path to this syntax in a variable named b now my next line of code is if b is equal to false that means we if we don't select any file then message box friendly message else this workbook dot worksheet let me minimize it sheet name is free as you can see here so Open parenthesis. Let me write the name of sheet name. Dot cell. Here I will give the address of that cell, which was seven and four, row number seven, and column number four. Dot value is equal to B because in B we have captured the path of file name. And this. So, this is the complete code. In B, we have captured path of selected file. If B is false, then we will give a message. And if we select any file, then row number 7 and column number 4. That means this cell will display the path. So let me check if our code is working. This button is still in design mode. So I will right click properties. I can change the caption like anything which you want. We can change the font as well. We can do anything in terms of appearance of button using the property window and now i will click on design mode to come out of design mode and if i click here i am getting the window or browsing window again i can select any file and open i am getting the address so this is how we can write simple code on the click event of button 
and learn with a step by step thank you for watching this video